today's adventure we're going to be baking a loaf of bread with 50 year old wheat it hasn't been ground for 50 years thank goodness but it came from a friend's food storage she's been clearing it out and she had some old wheat and then had a friend grind it up for me so we're gonna put this to the test i know that wheat can last a really long time if it hasn't been ground and we are gonna bake this up and see how it tastes if you want the recipe it's in the comments i also have another video where i go over how to bake the perfect loaf of bread and that is the same recipe and process i'll be using today so in case you need the specifics it's in that video but for today we're just gonna speed right through it so we're gonna see how this works out It's getting super stretchy, but we'll see if we can need some stretch into here. Now it's getting much stretchier. Normally when we make wheat bread, we usually mix in about half or more of all-purpose flour in with the wheat. But this time, I'm going all in. It is all 50-year-old wheat. All right, I think that's ready. We're gonna stick it in here, let it rise, and we'll come back when it's doubled in size. The bread is done cooking and it didn't fluff up quite as much as I anticipated. Maybe it's just a more dense bread. Of course, I gotta give credit to the fact that it is a solid wheat loaf, not even partially white. We're gonna cut some of this open and butter it up. See how it goes. There we go. This might make a better sandwich bread than my white bread loaf, since that one's so fluffy. It's hard to use in a sandwich. Here we go. Hmm. 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 That is actually really good. I'm surprised at how good it turned out. It actually tastes 10 times better than it looks. <laughs> it tastes really good and lovely and buttery. And it doesn't taste super dense. It tastes like a, like a sandwich bread dense. So it's really good. And thanks for watching, and I'm glad we got to make a loaf of bread with 50-year-old wheat. What? Uh, how many people get to do that, right? So, anyway, I'll catch you in the next video.